Google I.O. is one of the company's most important events of the year. It's where we usually learn about the next version of Android and get a sneak peek at Google's upcoming products. But in 2023, Google I.O. could be more important than ever. That's because we're expecting to hear more about Google's ambitions in artificial intelligence, especially now that this space has become fiercely competitive thanks to the popularity of ChatGPT. Of course, we won't know what Google has in store for I.O. until the event takes place on May 10th. But based on Google's recent announcements, there are some clues we can piece together. Google usually discusses updates to major products like Search, Gmail, Photos, and more at Google I.O. AI touches on all of those services, and we're expecting to hear more about that at this year's conference. Google already made headlines earlier this year when it unveiled its own ChatGPT rival called BART. And now, it's said to be building a completely new AI-powered search engine according to the New York Times. If this is true, there's a chance we could hear about this new search engine at Google I.O. Google also previously announced new AI-powered tools that are coming to Gmail and Google Docs to make writing and organizing notes easier. I wouldn't be surprised if we heard more about this at I.O. too. Google has already been using AI for years. It's already a core part of its major products. We're all probably familiar with Smart Reply and Gmail, for example. But now, Google wants to put AI to use in different ways. Imagine if catching up on long email threads was as easy as typing a query into Google Search. That's the kind of future Google is promising based on the features it's teased so far. Google plans to put AI to use in a lot of other ways too, like building presentations and drafting documents. But the idea of how AI could be used to help navigate my email inbox more easily is what excites me the most, especially now that many of us are working remotely at least part of the time. Staying on top of emails and other workplace messages is more important than ever. Yes, there are already plenty of filters in Gmail, and Gmail's search function is already pretty good and it makes it easier to sift through large piles of emails. But Gmail is missing that conversational element that we've seen in so many of Google's other products, like its main search engine and the Google Assistant. Whatever Google's AI ambitions may be, I'm also hoping it spends a good amount of time talking about how it plans to make sure these tools are being used the right way. AI chatbots still have plenty of problems when it comes to accuracy, and it's up to companies like Google to address that and mitigate any consequences. Google's Bard was already called out for presenting inaccurate information, so it's clearly something Google will have to prioritize moving forward. We're sure to hear more about Google's AI plans at I.O. If for no other reason, Google will want to prove that it's keeping pace with Microsoft. The company made headlines earlier this year when it released a version of its Bing search engine that uses the tech behind ChatGPT to provide more conversational answers. Now, the New York Times is reporting that Samsung is considering replacing Google's search engine with Microsoft's Bing as the default engine on its devices. Google, now it's your turn. So what are you hoping to see at Google's conference? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to follow CNET for more coverage of Google and AI. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.